Welcome to DeflectTouch, a game for multi-touch tables. It's written in Python and uses the open source multi-touch framework Kiwi. We're now on the play area. On the left you can see sort of a tank. It can be dragged up and down and the barrel angle can be adjusted. In the middle you see a lot of grey bricks. These are obstacles. But there are also a few blue bricks. The goal of the game is to hit the blue bricks with a bullet from the tank. Therefore you can play so-called deflectors by touching the screen with two fingers. They can be resized, rotated and moved around. But you also may have noticed that the bar on the bottom has been increased. This bar displays the current material stock for your deflectors. As you can see, as I place more of them or increase their size, the bar shrinks accordingly. So if you have too much deflector material used, the deflector can't be enlarged anymore. So you either have to shorten some of them or delete them. They can be deleted by making them short enough. So let's just try this level. First I reset the level to its original state. Then I place a tank and a deflector. Finally I hit fire. If the bullet hits an obstacle or the wall, I lose one of my three lives. If I lost them all, the level will be reset. If you accomplish one, you automatically get to the next level. If you finished all 8 levels on one row, the next row will be unlocked. If the levels button is red, it hasn't been done yet, and if it's black, it's still locked. There's also a setting dialog over here. From here you can access a quick start guide containing some tips. You can also set up the sound volume, the bullet speed and of course the music volume.